Hello everybody, welcome to the CSL, CSTL rather, week one. This is um, uh, the first match between Jess Cheese League and Proxy Toss Girl. Joined with me is Narwhal. Say hi, hi. Narwhal. <laughs> How's it going? You want to introduce our players for us? Absolutely. In our bottom, let's see if I can get my left and right <laughs> figured out. Hold on. Right <laughs> corner, we've got Hummingbird. He's our green and he is currently Zerg. He plays random, but he's Zerg this game. And down in the bottom left, we've got Empty Biosis, who is our red, also Zerg player. Yes, indeed. And Bio's on the stream right now. And um, yeah, so just give a little background on this, uh, this uh, league real quick, right? This is the CSTL, the Curvy Star Team League, um, a team league for the Penny Arcade community run by the Penny Arcade community. If you want to join us, um, you can check us out on uh, channel PA on the North American server. You can also check out the thread on the Penny Arcade forums, of which the, the, the URL is too long, so it's just not linked. But what the hell? Are you looking at Bio's base right now? Did you see that? Two drones yeah. were making out a second ago. That's incredible. <laughs> um, and so you can check us out there. This is week one of the league. It's uh, four teams, uh, people of all various skill sets, um, Bio being a total scrub. He's our diamond player, he's, but unfortunately, poor Bio had to go up against a uh, grandmaster because not all the the matchups are going to be even. So, um, we see uh, right here in the beginning, he's already sent out a scout because he doesn't know what Hummingbird's playing this round. He has to send out that early scout, whereas Hummingbird's, you know, still basically he sent out his overlords, but he's still kind of just hanging out in his base. Yes. Indeed. Got well, let's be fair here, Narwhal. And, and by the way, I think Humming just went 10 over pool gas. He's just going to bailing Bio to death. Anyways, um, Bio is indeed the third best person, the, or best StarCraft player in the UK. Did you know that? <laughs> uh, I did not. So, what, the Muslim being the first? Yeah, so we have the Muslim and Bling, and you can argue which one's better at the time. Right now, Bling's doing pretty well, and recently, Bling actually just got a personal sponsorship from the fourth best player in the UK, Total Biscuit. Oh, looks like Blings are coming in. They're going to be killing that drone. Um, oh, not. <laughs> That's okay. But yeah, yeah, so Bio is the third oh, best player sending, in the UK. He's sending a Zergling back just to get the drone, but the drone is headed straight into the base where it will say hello to the queen, and... Uh... And we'll take it out. Yeah, let's see. What does Bio have right now? He has four Zerglings. He's getting a Bangling Nest. That's a pretty good response. Luckily, Hummingbird doesn't know where the hell Bio is, so he's going to be going all the wrong places, giving Bio that precious time to be able to get up some defenses. And in fact, both Bangling Nests are roughly up at the same time. Uh, Humming is going to have about a four-second lead on um, Bio. Wow, he really did go the wrong place. Um, right, but... He quickly realizes, and he's turning around, and he's already checked the top right, and so there's only one place left where Bio could possibly be, and he's just going to send everything in. Yep, and it looks like we have 14 lings from Hummingbird, 10 from Bio. Uh, Bio should be able to hold this off. Um, he has the reinforcement advantage, um, and also... Let's and look he's starting to morph some Banelings in. Ooh. They're both actually doing Banelings at the moment. Um, I think Hummingbird, he's got three at the moment. And he and there goes a fourth. Where is that fourth? There it is. Yeah, he had some more reinforcements coming in, but Hummingbird's just starting to stream in a lot of units. Oh, here comes the micro. This is this is why Bio is indeed the third best player in the UK. Uh, loses one Banelings to I don't know what. However, the Banelings, two Banelings are just running in right past the expansion, just going straight into Bio's base. Yeah. Where they will beat the drones and... Oh god. Okay, well that actually wasn't that bad of a hit. Um, the, the bad part is that Bio did lose the rest of his links to Hummingbird's forces. Um, Hummingbird's just gonna stream in here. And this is the end of the game. <laughs> no, no, I ha- oh. Uh -oh. oh, that's a shame. <laughs> oh, I was a split second ahead of you, I guess. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay, that's that thing. Thank Blizzard for that. So, yeah, that was game one. Hummingbird takes in a pretty convincing fashion. Um, in a quick ZVZ. Um, final thoughts on that one, Narwhal? Well, I mean, not really. I just, you saw a lot of forces coming in for Hummingbird. As soon as he could pinpoint where Bio was, he just had more stuff. Yeah, and that's the difference between a Grandmaster and a Diamond player. Just that's okay. I, I suspect Bio will be jumping back. He is a very resilient UK player, and um, the, the United Kingdom is known for jumping back. 
Uh, but unfortunately, this this next replay is at, uh, a whole minute shorter. Or no, no, no. <laughs> don't a minute longer. I lied. I lied. No spoilers. No spoilers. Before we spoil more, we'll get into game two, and we'll be right back. <laughs> 